Hello everyone, it has been a while since I've uploaded any videos. I hope you guys are doing fine. For this one, we're going to check out the loot from the 4 wins prize bags. It is a container that can be only obtained during the festival of the 4 wins from a daily achievement. And it is tradable, so it's also possible to get them from the trading post. I managed to slowly buy them for roughly 40 silver each. That would be right around a thousand gold for all the bags. As for the loot table, it doesn't seem to have anything crazy in it. You basically always receive one champion bag and at least 25 festival tokens for each container open. And then you also have a small chance of looting a watchwork weapon, additionally with the two guaranteed items. The weapons are not worth much though, most of them can be bought on the trading post for just a few gold. These boxes feel similar to the super loot bags. A good portion of their value comes from the festival currency rather than just the gold itself. Speaking of festival currency, I was receiving so many tokens when opening the bags. I had to often switch map to remove the lag. That's why the background keeps changing. Hopefully it's not too annoying. I apologize about that. Alrighty, that was all the 4 wins prize bags. I am just going to quickly open all the champion bags. You always receive one, so that is exactly 2.5 thousand champion bags. We also received 29 watchwork weapons, almost 69 thousand festival tokens, and the happy little amount of 11 silver and 16 copper in liquid gold, that's gonna pay the gas. Maybe. From these type of festival containers, the usual chance of looting a rare weapon seems to be around 1%. We got 29 weapons out of 2.5k bags, so that would make the chance approximately 1.1% and the gold value around 127 gold. I did say in the past that I would try to open all the unidentified gears I receive in my videos, but I had to make an exception with this one since this video is a bit late and I was afraid that I was not going to have enough time to deal with the extra loot. I am sorry about that. Luckily though, they are tradable, so we can still have an accurate value for them. All the unidentified gears, as well as all the exotic stuff we received, is worth around 110 gold. The materials received from the champion bags are worth 108 gold. And the total amount of liquid gold we looted is 48 gold. Most of it came from the champ bags. And in case anyone is curious, the total amount of bloodstone received is 12,492. That would make the total value of all the loot received worth 396 gold. I did not include the worth of the bloodstone dust and the acid armor box since it's hard to give a clear value on those items. And to conclude, I end up losing 600 gold but gain 68,000 festive tokens. That would make the average worth of 1 4 wins price bags around 15 silver and 27 festival tokens. The price bags definitely don't give great amount of gold, so it all comes down to if you need the festival tokens or not. Even though the festival is over, you can talk to these two scripts in Lion's Arch and have access to buying some of the festival items. If nothing interests you, or if you're not missing any funds, then it would be better for you to sell the bags to the trading post. That is going to be it for this video. Even though it was uploaded a bit late, I hope it was still useful or entertaining to some. I have a video about Zephyrite supply boxes that should be coming up soon, so I will see you guys again very soon. Bye-bye.